is settled off in fourth place and it's likely to be a strong gallop here both young Hustler and Barton Bank uh, race with the pace uh, often one man will go off the 11 to 8 on favourites Scott and Banks 9 to 2 young Hustler 11 to 2 and Barton Bank the 6 to 1 outsider of the four and it's young Hustler in the yellow sleeve jacket that just shows the way into the back straight a long run to the first fence must cover a good best part of a quarter of a mile before they reach the first obstacle Barton Bank in second in the center of the three leaders Scott and Bank on the outside left of picture pale blue jacket and finally one man the first down the back then young Hustler and Barton Bank good jumps there the pair of them in third is Scott and Banks and then one man the second is an open ditch Barton Bank on the outside of young Hustler Barton Bank accelerating into the fence and took it really well from young Hustler on the inside and then Scott and Banks and one man and they are not hanging about at the water jump Barton Banks again cleared it with feet to spare in second young Hustler it's a little bit awkward and then Scott and Banks and one man another plain fence coming up Barton Bank again brushed through it uh, from young Hustler in second who's been shaken off at this stage Scott and Banks the outside and then one man the last in the back straight now and Barton Bank leads them towards it with a useful lead three or four lengths over safely young Hustler a big jump in second Scott and Banks and then one man just lobbing along last of the four so they're about to swing left-handed out of the back straight and Barton Bank still out in front from young Hustler Scott and Banks in third and one man waiting to pounce in last place of the four Jim they've gone pretty fast and furious over the first few fences and so far Barton Bank jumping well yeah Adrian set out and really scorched them up for the first um, half mile or so he steadied it down after that bend but uh, Scott and Banks has been a little bit slower through the air than the other three but Touchwood all of them jumping well so far and the next is an open ditch and it takes some jumping Barton Bank who blundered at it a few years ago in this race over safely there young hustler the inside Scott and Banks out wide and one man the next is the seventh they jump 18 in all in this uh, three mile and a furlong Charlie Hall chase Barton Bank again foot perfect young hustler just ran down the fence slightly in second one man goes third and then Scott and Banks well down the straight then well over a circuit in front of them Barton Bank again very fluent at it young hustler slightly right-handed in second rather took one man with him there and then Scott and Banks and this will be the last after another circuit confirmation of starting prices now one man 11 to 8 on Scott and Banks five to one all oh, Barton Bank he wasn't really able to fiddle there he was in too close didn't get high and uh, hit the fence fairly hard it's early days it uh, wouldn't take much uh, out of him at this stage Adrian Maguire just humoring the horse packing him down the neck after the fence trying to boost his confidence Scott and Banks now goes second in third is young hustler and one man remains last of the four under a patient ride from Richard Dunwoody so they pass their departure point and swinging away from the grandstands again and about to take a, a downhill run along the side of the course and it's Barton Bank who's made it all so far young hustler the inside and then Scott and Banks who's closer than he was a few fences back and one man still in last place they swing left-handed again into the back straight a line of five fences down there the sequence is a plain one an open ditch water and two plain ones follow and then they'll have another four fences in the home straight after that coming to the first of those now then Barton Bank by two lengths to Young Hustler in second one man has gone third Scott and Banks drops back to fourth again may just be a little bit tap for toe at this stage so a long way to go Barton Bank on towards another open ditch the penultimate open ditch and Barton Bank into it first great jump by one man up, up the outside there really took off out of Richard Dunwoody's hands Young Hustler the inside and Scott and Banks is just struggling to go with them over the water jump Barton Bank landed in front two or three lengths to the good over Young Hustler one man still cruising cruising along on the outside as they take another plane fence the three leaders land safely and they're well in advance now of Scott and Banks who's a good eight or ten lengths behind one man in th who's in third place the last in the back straight Barton Bank leads them to it let's see how they take it Barton Bank from one man closing up on the outside another good jump young hustler who's well favored by the weights today is still in touch on the inside and we know he'll battle all the way and then Scott and Banks in last place of the four so they swing left-handed out of the back straight for the final time now and about to turn into the home straight where four obstacles await them and it's Barton Bank the winner of this race 
twice previously who shows them the way but one man waiting to pick him up in second place apparently full of running look at scott and banks now rallying as uh, stamina comes into play down the outside young hustler a little bit uh, one pace in fourth they race towards the final open ditch this is four out barton bank the inside of one man barton bank awkward one man out jumped him and they're pulling clear of young hustler and then scott and banks one man is absolutely running away down towards the final three fences this is three out coming up one man the leader the big gray horse from barton bank in second who's done so much of the donkey work back in third young hustler who can make little impression neither can scott and banks and they're all gonna have to go to beat this one man the second last one man put himself right at it barton banks is staying on bravely in second place now richard dunwoody shakes up the gray horse who gallops three four lengths clear relentlessly from barton bank in second young hustler third and scott and banks the final fence one man he's safely over another brilliant leap richard dunwoody looks round for non-existent dangers back in second is barton banks third is young hustler and fourth is scott and banks that's how they're finished this is a one-man show one man by eight lengths maybe more barton banks second in third young hustler then scott and banks last of the four runners well you couldn't ask for much better than that one man the 11 to 8 on favorite and a brilliant winner of this charlie hall chase on his first appearance since that flop in the tote cheltenham gold cup nothing wrong with him today whatsoever he's come back in brilliant fashion showing his very best form but in some prodigious leaps down the back straight and he's getting a warm reception as he makes his way back to the winner's enclosure here at weatherby a very popular horse in this part of the world very popular horse throughout national hunt racing he's got uh, so much natural talent as jim mcgrath said earlier and on the run-in he'd already put his seal on the race barton bank in second place made a bold bid to win it for the third time and uh, finished well clear of the other two but uh, he just couldn't hold a light to this one man he's just pushed out as the post loomed but he's won easily